The 80-year-old pontiff told Catholic TV 2000 that sometimes when he prays for long periods of time, he dozes off. But St. Therese did it too he said, referring to a 19th century nun. David Green, host throughout this morning, will be hearing the latest on the investigation into yesterday's terror attack in New York City. A man drove a rented truck into a group of pedestrians and bikers, killing at least eight people and injuring 11. Sound bite of archived recording Bill de Blasio This was an act of terror, and a particularly cowardly act of terror, aimed at innocent civilians, aimed at people going about their lives who had no idea what was about to hit them. Green that's the voice there of New York City Mayor Bill de Blasio. He and Governor Andrew Cuomo praised first responders for putting an end to this attack shortly after it began. Rachel Martin, host Leslie Danoff PH was also grateful to the quick action of first responders. She lives near the site of the attack. Her husband heard gunshots from inside their apartment, and she could see bodies on the ground from her window. Sound bite of archived recording Leslie Danoff We have so many schools around this area. There is a high school and a middle school, and then across the street a community college and just down the block an elementary school. And it was shortly after three. It could have been worse if the police hadn't responded as quickly as they did. Green now, New York's Governor Cuomo said there would be an increased police presence in New York City, but he added that there is no sign of an ongoing threat. Sound bite of archived recording Andrew Cuomo be New Yorkers, and live your life. And don't let them change as or deter us in any manner, shape or form. Copyright Copyright 2017 Nepalese Rupees. All rights reserved. Visit our website Terms of Use and Permissions pages at www.npr.org for further information. NPR transcripts are created on a rush deadline by Verb ATM, Inc., an NPR contractor, and produced using a proprietary transcription process developed with NPR. This text may not be in its final form and may be updated or revised in the future. Accuracy and availability may vary. The authoritative record of NPR's programming is the audio record.